Um, it started years ago when a, a group called the Pink Ladies um, asked my wife if um, we would like to get involved helping uh, children. And she said yes without asking me. And then a couple of days later they brought me three children. We realized that there was a need out there for these children, the abused, abandoned and abused children. The abused women and children that, that comes into the house, we create a clean, safe environment for them to try and um, get them back on track uh, to, to live a normal life. So we just create the space for them and they must do the work. Well, we started off doing it on our own, me and Benedict, um, um, supporting the families that come in here financially until my money dried up. And we've got some wonderful people in the valley that is assisting but we do need more help. Yeah, we've got um, two moms, 23 children that lives with us in the house that we are helping. We've got an in-house social worker. We do have therapists, counselors that comes in and assist us with the, with the eating processes. To see the outcome of getting a baby in our six months old or four months old and seeing them grow, that is the success. There's nothing frightening about this work that we are doing, if it comes from the heart. The best piece of advice that I've ever received is when I got married, the priest told me a one word, dialogue, you know, that you must share. The way I understood it was that love is to give unconditionally. And, and if I give unconditionally and my partner gives unconditionally, uh, it will just be great and that is just what we do and uh, this is the way we're going, it's to give you know? and not just to give a little bit, just to give everything. <music>